hola chomis six years simply original and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you a recipe that makes the softest fluffiest and most delicious pancakes and most if not all the ingredients you should be able to find them in your kitchen without further ado let's get right into the kitchen I'm going to make this recipe as detailed as possible for whoever that wants to save their partner with breakfast in bed with something new. Firstly, we are going to start with mixing the dry ingredients. I poured a reasonable amount of flour into a bowl. I didn't really have specific measurements and then followed by salt and baking powder. Baking powder is the one that gives the pancakes the softness and fluffiness because of the air bubbles it triggers. I lastly added sugar for taste and mix everything homogeneously and after that I put Put it aside now for the wet ingredients i'm going to use two eggs for this recipe here i'm pouring a bit of melted butter then i added fresh milk you can use any milk of your choice being it coconut milk or whatsoever you prefer you can as well substitute the milk with water however it tastes better when done with milk for scents and flavor i am using vanilla flavor in this case but you can use any of your choice after mixing the wet ingredients i incorporate the wet ingredients into the dry ingredients and mix homogeneously i personally prefer having pancakes for breakfast or maybe brunch but some people don't mind having it for supper or dinner other people even have it as a starter and others as a dessert so whichever time you want to have it go for it there's a saying that says <laughs> pancakes are judged by the taste and not by the shape or the size so bear with me ladies and gentlemen if the shapes of my pancakes and the sizes are not gonna be uniform i used butter for frying my pancakes however you can use whatever oil you have at hand because of the sizes that i was aiming for i was doing two scoops per pancake if you want your pancakes bigger you can put the mixture until it covers the base of the pan and if you want them smaller you make smaller scoops after you put the mixture into the pan you will know that now is the right time to turn the pancake what will direct you are the bubbles or the holes that will form on top of the pancake as you can see right there i honestly feel like it's a very easy recipe to make it does not require any sort of extraordinary skills or whatsoever all you need to have are your ingredients and also just make sure that you turn them at the right time so that you don't burn your pancakes if you feel like the pan is too dry you add more butter or whatever oil it is that you are using to fry your pancakes with let me remind you to like the video if you haven't done so yet also let's engage in the comment section below tell me everything tell me what you think about my recipe about my videos in general and also what you want to see more on my channel with that being said thank you all so much for watching i hope you have learned something new today and that you have also enjoyed watching the video look at the fluffiness the lightness of these pancakes the most important thing to take note is that the more the baking powder the fluffier the pancake and if you want flat pancakes leave the baking powder out